Surprise, surprise, motherfucker! The king is back! Good to see this talented fighter make the walk again once tonight. Gotta think he'll look to use his speed and footwork in this fight. Those appear to be his biggest advantages. Maybe not the most powerful guy on the roster necessarily, but exceptionally quick on the feet. Very good at using his feet to set up angles for his offense and will mix it up. A lot of variations to his attacks. Can fight on the outside, but also not afraid to enter the pocket to stick and move. Great job of moving that head off the center line. Just an outstanding striker who brings a lot of different attributes to the table. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You wanted to be that charismatic. You wanted to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick. 10,000 times unloosely in Just so wise. And now our kill the tape for this heavyweight fight. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Iron. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Herb Dean is your referee. Ready. He's the third man in the octagon Ready. tonight. Good. All right, so here we are from the world's most famous arena. It is, of course, Madison Square Garden. This is where the Thug Rose scene went down, DC. This is where it happened, J.A. Lost for words, so I yelled the same thing over and over again. Pick Rose Namajunas, and you can hear me yell, Thug Rose, Thug Rose, Thug Rose. <laughs> the uppercut flails and misses. Lands a nasty body kick. Until he blocks it, you better keep throwing those body kicks. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find it home. Oh, Superman punch lands. Went for the inside leg kick. Switch kick lands. Oh, nice body shot. Let him go. Time to let those hands go. Shoot. Oh, caught him with the head kick. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh, lands a beautiful jab. Finish, finish. Nice straight there by Liz. Oh, a huge block relax, there. Relax, keep your hands up for me. Just 
over three minutes to go round one. Oh, nice counter jazz there. Lead left by Lee. Oh, how good was that combo? He is really doing a nice job stringing his shots together now. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice combination there. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Nice kick. Oh, pretty good technique as he lands the sidekick, DC. Real nice technique to land that sidekick. He did a great job of getting that leg up and then right through the target. And that one certainly found the target. Pretty good position here with the single collar in the clinch. Oh, big knees! Good fight here under two to go. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. He's landing them upside his opponent's head over and over again. He's trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Oh, hard work pays off, lands the Superman punch flush. Throwing that jab, no good. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body. He hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He has certainly found his range on the feet. I mean, when you don't check, you're going to continue to get blasted with kicks. His opponent has not deterred him from keeping on throwing those kicks. Fast, hard head kick there. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Lee go with the kick to the body. He's an outstanding kicker, but that attempt missed. Man, he's got good hands. Beautiful strike there. Round one winding down here. Oh, nice single, yes. Round two next. Hey, stop. All right, let's take a look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC, and there was plenty of it. Yeah, and it was the knees. Every time you saw an opening, he took it, man. You can really damage guys with knees to the body. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. All right, so as this next round gets underway, hopefully the good action we saw in the last round will continue. Both fighters certainly had their ups and downs. Both got the offense going. But now we'll see if one fighter or the other can really take control of what has been a very close fight thus far. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, look, look. Ooh. Yet another huge kick lands. Beautiful kick to the body. Back and forth we go.
just misses there with the left. This pace is just absurd, and he has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater. Punches and punches. I mean, being there, watching Max Holloway do what he did was super impressive. So to even list this performance alongside that tells you how this guy is fighting tonight. Well, he's had next to no answers for the body shots here tonight, and now some redness really starting to develop on that side. We're starting to see the damage. We're starting to visibly see the effect that all these body strikes are taking on this guy. He's got to do something different. And he's got to be very careful because look for his opponent to go over the top now that he set him up. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Big right hand. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. And he's looking for that left hand just missed. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has the biggest issue right thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Oh, he's still hurt. Look at that. He can't even stand. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover. And it's almost like he let him off the hook. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that finish. Well, he's cut above the eye, and that blood figures to start to trickle down. Could compromise his vision here moving forward. Oh! Now he to sway with every huge shot being landed. Back and forth we go. Oh, he's wobbling now. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. All right, that calf kick starting to show some visible signs of bruising now. And it's exciting him. He's excited to see that all the work that they've done in preparation is showing itself in the octagon. Oh, back and forth we go. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. There's that side kick. Under a minute to go here in our second round. Kick lands. Taking a lot of body shots this round. Oh! Cable into right there. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Man, he is hurting for certain. I don't care how many planks, crunches you do, the body is not meant to absorb that type of dance. No, you can prepare yourself so thoroughly and still not be ready for this because this has been hard to watch. This guy has taken every shot that his opponent has thrown to his body. I'm amazed that he's even still standing right now. Huh. Two rounds in the books. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent's staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Third round underway. All right, so big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Oh, clipped him with the left. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. 
Oh, he lands another strike to the body here and just continues to punish his opponent's body here in this round, just like he did in the previous one. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Oh, head kick, bang. Lee gets caught by that straight hand. Well, this is absolutely the hurt business. It's hard to see which party is more injured, but I think both fighters have been really affected with their strikes in this race. Yeah, both guys have been affected. Both guys have been beat up. It's a very competitive fight. Let's see who has the heart to carry them through these very tough moments. Beautiful uppercut there. Both fighters starting to open up a little bit. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter evades. Oh, nice spinning heel kick. Oh, man, the blood is flowing now. I know a lot of you like that, but he has got to figure some things out defensively or this fight's going to end. He's got to move his head, John. But the problem is... You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such a... range with that right hand. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Oh, nice inside leg kick, yeah. We have crossed the midpoint of this one. his opponent can take. Massive shot. That he landed. Great job. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Oh, he connects there. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Nice display of technique by him there on the sidekick. Now he's oh, he got hurt again. Oh, counters with a beautiful left hand. Ninety seconds to go. Good work, guys. Shot is blocked. And now that they're being thrown on both sides. Straight counter. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Oh, looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Try to establish that jab. Nice crack there. There's the horn. How about that round? He got him badly there early on. You thought that maybe that was going to be the beginning of the end. At the very least here, got to think he's going to try to get him out of here in this next round. J.A., he's on skates. I yeah. mean, he was on skates. His ability to withstand that avalanche 
is commendable, but he has to change something as he approaches the next round. All right, let us get you some replays from the damage in that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the shot that opened the cup. I mean, just some big shots landed over the course of that round. And he wasn't responsible defensively. He was trying to tough out way too many situations. You can't do that when you're fighting a guy like this. He doesn't change something, he's gonna find himself in trouble. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really... Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Lee's really taking aim at that cut right now, and hard to blame him, right? They might even call in the ringside physician. He is continuing to target that area. Well, the body work's starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Fighter lands a left punch now. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Well, he is clearly faded in this one, and I'm not talking about the high and tight skin fade on my man Daniel Cormier. He got stunned earlier in the round, and, and mentally I feel like he checked out a little bit. Oh, huge shot finds the target there. Great shot, man. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, big left. Just over three minutes now to go. What a great job getting that kick to the target. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Oh, he's in a lot of trouble. Relax, relax. Keep your hands up for me now. Cable inches right there. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Beautiful punch lands. to the body by Lee. Finds a home for that left hook. Right, keep pushing forward. Let's go. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. He cannot take those leg kicks clean like that. But he needs to check one of these kicks. He has to discourage him from throwing this kick over and over again. Under two minutes to go in the round. All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut, and man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flowing. Yeah, as it should be. Right? He should be focused on getting to that cut, making his opponent pay. He did the work. He opened up the cut. Now it's on him to continue on the path and make the ringside position come in here and try to stop it. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end this fight. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. There's that kick. Beautiful body kick. Right hook to the head block. Under a minute now to go. Oh, nice. Oh, the high kick lands. Really nice left hand there. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. 
There's the leg kick that one checked by Lee. Ten seconds remaining here in round four. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. All right, so there's the end of the round. Big story in this one now. The cut on the bridge of that nose from that strike. The cut man is in there. Should be able to shut this one and potentially prevent it from being a factor here moving forward. All right, as they attend to the damaged fighter, we will re-rack some replays for you. A lot of damaging strikes landed by the opposition in that previous round. Well, him just not really paying attention on the defensive side has made his opponent look like an absolute world beater. He's a good fighter, but he has never looked this good. And that is, that is partly because his opponent is not defending. Ready to fight? Ready. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Big power shot there. All right, so able to get the hands going once again. He lands another punch. Nice work on the feet by Lee. Nice jab. Oh, and he caught the kick. Let me see that hook now. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Nice job by him defensively there. Just missing on the high kick there. They're so evenly matched, and they're going to attack. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Well, you can chalk this up to a forgettable night at the office. He is losing the fight. His cardio is essentially on empty. Might be time to pass that control. It's time to pass the stick. Hand it over to your homeboy, man. It's over. That's right. It's for effort, but it's over. Able to check that kick as well. Oh, nice kick. Grips the body there. He missed with that jab attempt there. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Great body kick there. Got to the clinch, controlled the posture, and land some big knees from in close. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Go after the cut. End this fight. End it. Big inside kick. Oh, yes, it is a lost art in mixed martial arts. Not just the jab, but the double jab. I mean, a beautiful double jab. That thing's throwing right from the chin, too. And that spinning kick found its home up top. Two minutes and counting to go in this fight. Well, an incredible fight thus far. Both fighters look like they could be finished at any time. If you wondered about the heart on either side, that question was answered. To Nothing. There are no more questions in regards to these two fighters. Both of these men have been hurt. Both of these men are swollen. They're bloody. They're both, even though them, they're both willing and ready to continue this fight. Big shot to the head. Defense. Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by Lee. Oh, nice kick. Well, missed on that one. Under a minute now to go in this one. Oh, 
extra perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, nice. Great block there. Man, that cut is so bad, you wonder if at some point that is gonna start to affect his breathing. Twenty seconds now remain in the round. Fifteen seconds to go. Oh, good block there. Oh, you gotta start to look to finish him now. Back and forth action right until the final horn. That one's gonna hold up in the fight of the year conversation. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50 46. For the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's going to get everyone's best shot, but more often.